penalties, the ordinance is worthless. I'd like to have your response. Thank you, Harry Kibler. No response. Yesterday morning, good morning, Mr. Bauer. I'd like to hear from you. Um, I know he may be a little uh, challenged with electronic communication, so I'm not sure if some of this is just misspellings or, or what. Uh, he writes back, this is Shad's ordinance, not mine. He brought the amendments and the ordinance passed. If you want additional amendments, contact him. Wait a minute. You're my elected county councilman. You have as much authority to offer an amendment as anybody else sits on that council. And you're telling me that if I want something changed, go talk to him? You're my representative on council. So I wrote him back. I said, I want to know where you stand on putting penalties in the ordinance to punish anyone who violates the intent of the ordinance. Well, that's, that's really mean-spirited, isn't it? He writes back, I can't answer that until I see what is proposed. It was already passed. Did you all understand what I'm trying to ask you? I'm just simply saying, will you support putting penalties back in? And this is the response. Um, so I texted him back. I said, I asked a very specific question, Mr. Bauer. As it stands right now, a county employee can cooperate with a federal agency and there are no penalties for violating the ordinance. I simply want to know if you are in favor of adding penalties for violating the ordinance. Again, it's a pretty straightforward question. He said, he responds, as I stated specifically, and it has always been my position on any subject that may come before council, I do not comment or speculate on how I will vote until the information has been presented to council. So my boss at work, where I work, if he says, Harry, what do you plan on doing about this problem? I look at him and say, I'm sorry, I don't comment or speculate about stuff like that. <laughs> how long do you think I keep my job? So I went back and I said, I'll take your response as you don't really support protection of gun rights for gun rights, and you just wanted to have an election issue for sound bites to the uneducated public. Thank you. He says, take it however you want. My next question was, when is your next re-election? He didn't respond. He didn't respond. Folks, this